Hi everybody, welcome back to Daisy and look at these beautiful, beautiful helicopters. So I think it's either today or the last couple of days, Red Falcon's new helicopter mod has just dropped. Now this is a work in progress mod. Um, but already he has made some amazing strides forward. So in the description below this video, I'll put a link to Red Falcon's um, Daisy Steam Workshop page where you can subscribe to the mod. What's brilliant about this one is that it is free and it doesn't have any dependencies. So it's kind of a standalone mod because, okay, there's some amazing helicopters in expansion, but expansion is a right nightmare to install. There's various other free helicopter mods that are, let's just say they're a little bit questionable, but Red Falcon seems to have done, you know, he's ticked all the right boxes with this one. Now in the description below the Steam mod, there's links to his discord as well you can go over there and you can find things like the the trader files and there's also rudimentary types files as well i couldn't see any cfg spawnable types files so i might try and knock something up over the next few days but go over there join his discord say hello throw him a few bucks as well because this looks absolutely absolutely amazing so what i want to do in this video is just give it a little bit of a um uh, kind of a little bit of a show you kind of kind of what's going on um, now, with all the helicopters, you know, when you go up to them, um, they should, you know, you've got to fit a battery, uh, like a spark plug, hydraulic hoses, wiring hoses, I guess lights as well, maybe. Um, and they've got storage, and obviously different people can fly on them. Um, there is uh, little birds. Now, I don't think the little birds work at the moment. There's this um, twin rotor. I think this is a Russian helicopter, KA-26. That is a lot of fun to fly. And then you've got these guys, and then you've got the which these are what are these MMB MBBB 0105s, and then you've got these cool looking helicopters, well, Bell 249s. Now, the other thing that's pretty cool, I think, is when they crash, zombies spawn out of the um, the crash, which is really what a cool idea. Oh dear, that is. So when you, so if you crash and you die, you end up with zombies wandering around, which is which is very very cool indeed. Now this is a work in progress. So at the moment the controls are all done with um, uh, just kind of keyboard really. Um, but what I'll do? Let's take one of these babies up and I'll kind of uh, show you what it's like. So let's um, start the helicopter. And then to kind of go up, you have to roll your mouse wheel up and that'll put your collective up. And it's very much like a, a pendulum, the helicopters in this. So you want to make small adjustments and then it takes a while for those adjustments to take effect. So you've always got to kind of be thinking like 30 seconds a minute ahead. So we've got a bit of height. So what we can do is now we can use W just to tip her forward so we'll then start moving forward they are planning on putting mouse uh, a mouse support for flying as well so that's pretty cool and then we can tip her over and just gradually sort of turn around can put a little bit of rudder on as well Helicopters and Daisy just go together so well, don't they? Inside of helicopters look great. So now you see, I've got to be thinking ahead. I've got to think I can start straightening her out. Start slowing her down a bit. Raise the nose a little bit to reduce our forward momentum. Slowly bring her down. Thank you. 
Ooh, coming down a little bit hard. Ooh. 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 <sighs> We're rolling. <sighs> oh, okay. So, <laughs> obviously a little bit of work to do on the, um, the crash model. Um, but I'm still in one piece. Um, but how cool does this baby look? I did crash a helicopter earlier, as you can see, that's where the smoke comes from. But I think Red Falcon has made an amazing start, and they're usable now. Yeah. So go over to Steam, visit his site, go over his, get subscribe to the mod. Um, I'd highly recommend you install this on a local server and play around with it on your local PC to start off with. Um, and uh, yeah, really looking forward to seeing what Red Falcon comes up with because this is absolutely amazing. Anyway, that's enough from me, and I'll see you again soon.